Good morning, grade 7 students. This is Ms. Rita checking back in with you on Wednesday, March 18, 2020 with the homework correction of the reading passage, Last Wish of a Fireman. Let's go ahead and start with question number one. Each one of you might have learned something different. However, what I learned as a reader is that at the time of adversary, the almighty powerful God is there for help. In the following question, answers do vary. Therefore, if you have a question in regards of whether your answer is correct or incorrect, please feel free to contact me and we can go ahead and talk about it. Question number two. Who is the fireman in the title of the story above? The fireman in the above story is the dying child Billy, whose wish in life was to be a fireman. And luckily, this final wish came to be true. Question number three. Why wasn't it possible for the mother in paragraph two to fulfill her child's dream when he grows up? It was impossible for the mother to fulfill Billy's future dreams because he was totally ill. As mentioned in the reading passage, he was ill due to leukemia, cancer in the blood. All she could do was to achieve his basic dream of becoming a fireman. Question number five. How did the fulfillment of the child's dream have positive medical effect on Billy? What can you infer from that? Well, based on the reading passage, they went ahead and stated that it made the child live three months longer than any doctor thought possible. Well, what can we infer from that? We can infer that the psychological factor of Billy being happy due to the fulfillment of his dream made a difference in facing his disease. Therefore, he was able to live three months longer. Last but not least, let's move on to question number seven. In the following question, answers do vary. Therefore, if you have a question whether your answer is correct or incorrect, please feel free to contact me. However, the story was very touching to me because, as stated in paragraph 11 and 12, the way the child died in peace with the angels singing for him was very touching and consoling. Great job, seventh grade. You guys are halfway done. Let's go ahead and wrap up the story with a couple more homework exercises. Your homework exercises for Friday, March 20th, 2020 are exercise B, D, E, and F on pages 136, 137, 138, and 139. Please go ahead and do your homework exercises on the copybook Answers Only, and I will check back in with you with the homework correction. Please, please, please feel free to contact me with any question you have or any misunderstanding of the story you have. Have a great day.